This video will demonstrate the difference between desk shields produced from polypropylene, and polycarbonate shields produced by ENT plastics. As you can see, polypropylene is a flammable material which, once lit on fire, will burn until all the material is consumed by the flame, unless it is extinguished by external means. The flame spreads up steadily and does not self-extinguish. In addition, a large amount of liquefied polypropylene pools on the desk and floor creating a very dangerous situation. If we hadn't extinguished the flames, the shield would have eventually been consumed. E&T Plastics Portable Desktop Shields are made from O60 gauge clear polycarbonate which is self-extinguishing, which means when the heat source, in this case the lighter, is removed, the plastic will burn slightly and eventually extinguish. It cannot be overstated how critical this feature is for a school environment. Our shield meets the latest New York State guidance, MPS 2606.2, for fire inhibiting furniture. Fire codes vary by location. Check with your local fire inspector on what products are allowable in your school districts. Polycarbonate is much more difficult to ignite than polypropylene. And once ignited, the flame is small and burns out quickly. As you can see, once the source of the fire is removed from the material, the material itself will not continue to burn. Remember, please do not try these burn tests at home. E&T Plastics desktop shields have many other outstanding features. They are made from virtually unbreakable polycarbonate. They can be dropped on a sidewalk or floor and will survive over and over again. Ease of handling is also a top priority. Our shield can be folded up, and with the convenient hand slots, can be carried from room to room, making cleaning and sanitizing a snap. Please ask us about our other desktop solutions for libraries, cafeterias and administrative offices. We can also customize our portable units to fit various desk sizes. You can find options and ideas on our website, www.e-tplastics.com.